In this tutorial, we'll learn how to set up and save filter personalizations in Oracle Fusion Data Intelligence, or FDI. A workbook state is a saved set of filters applied to a workbook. Managing them saves business users time from resetting the filters whenever a workbook is opened. For example, I'm an HR manager who frequently needs to filter a few specific business units. Instead of reapplying those filters every time, I can save that setup as a workbook state and jump right back in when I need it. I'll begin with a workforce management workbook delivered by Oracle. There are a few pre-built filters with selections already made for a year and business unit name. I can change this workbook state by clicking State menu and selecting Manage State. The Manage States dialog allows me to select the default state in which this dashboard will be opened. Currently, this dashboard is set to original state. I'll select last state and done, so the latest filter selections will be set as the default state when I reopen this dashboard later. I'll then change the year filter from 2025 to 2024 and set the business unit name to Australia Business Unit and job family to Human Resources. Since the workbook state is currently set to last state, I should see these same filter selections when I return to the workbook. I'll demonstrate this by exiting and returning to the workbook. I select Go Back to get to the home page. Then select my workbook again. When the workbook opens, the filters that were last selected are displayed since the Manage State setting is set to Last State. Now that I know how to change the default view, I want to create a custom workbook state with filter selections that I can return to whenever needed without reapplying the filters each time I open my workbook. I will create a custom workbook state and save it. I'll change the filter selections and then in State menu, I'll select Save State. I'll name this state as US Accounting and then select Save. To demonstrate the saved state, I'll change the filter selections once more. Then in the State menu, I'll select Apply State. I can select Original State, which was the last saved filter selection by the workbook author. Or I can select the saved state I created. Now I see my saved filter selections assigned to this state. I can also choose to set my custom save states as the default state. Note that I can create up to 15 states. If I create more than 15 states, the least used custom state is deleted every 90 minutes. Workbook states improve efficiency and save time when preparing filter selections for analytics consumers. Find additional videos in this series and more resources on using Fusion Data Intelligence in the links below.